Hi. Welcome to the History House. I'm Arma Saeed and you are watching The Significance of the 11th of October on your favorite The History House YouTube channel. Please like this video and subscribe the channel for the importance of the day, success stories as well as the failure stories around the world on daily basis. October 12th is the 285th day of the year, 286th in leap years, in the Gregorian calendar. 80 days remain until the end of the year. International Girl Child Day is celebrated on October 11th, Save Girl Child, Save Girls to Save Future Generations, Learning, Entertainment. 539 BC, the army of Cyrus the Great of Persia takes Babylon, ending the Babylonian Empire. Cyrus II of Persia commonly known as Cyrus the Great, and also called Cyrus the Elder by the Greeks, was the founder of the Achaemenid Empire, the first Persian Empire. Under his rule, the empire embraced all the previous civilized states of the ancient Near East, expanded vastly and eventually conquered most of Western Asia and much of Central Asia. From the Mediterranean Sea and Hellespont in the west to the Indus River in the east, Cyrus the Great created the largest empire the world had yet seen. Under his successors, the empire eventually stretched at its maximum extent from parts of the Balkans, Bulgaria Paeonia and Thrace Macedonia, and Eastern Europe proper in the west, to the Indus Valley in the east. Babylon was the capital city of Babylonia, a kingdom in ancient Mesopotamia, between the 18th and 6th centuries BC. It was built along the left and right banks of the Euphrates River with steep embankments to contain the river's seasonal floods. Babylon was originally a small Akkadian town dating from the period of the Akkadian Empire c. 2300 BC. 1279 The Nichiren branch of Buddhism is founded in Japan. Nichiren is a branch of Nichiren Buddhism based on the teachings of the 13th century Japanese Buddhist priest Nichiren -1282, claiming him as its founder through his disciple Nikko Shonen -1333, the founder of Head Temple Taiseki-ji, near Mount Fuji. Nichiren lay adherents are called Hokeko members. The Anishizan Myohoji Temple located in Los Angeles, California serves as the organization's headquarters within the United States. 1654 The Delft explosion devastates the city in the Netherlands, killing more than 100 people. Delft is a city and municipality in the province of South Holland, Netherlands. It is located between Rotterdam, to the southeast, and The Hague, to the northwest. Together with them, it is part of both Rotterdam The Hague metropolitan area and the Randstad. Delft is a popular tourist destination in the Netherlands, famous for its historical connections with the reigning house of Orange Nassau, for its blue pottery, for being home to the painter Jan Vermeer, and for hosting Delft University of Technology, 2 Delft. Historically, Delft played a highly influential role in the Dutch Golden Age. In terms of science and technology, thanks to the pioneering contributions of Antony van Leeuwenhoek and Martinus Bagerink, Delft can be considered to be the birthplace of microbiology. 1748 War of Jenkins Ear, a British squadron wins a tactical victory over a Spanish squadron off Havana. The Battle of Havana was a naval engagement that took place between the British Caribbean squadron and a Spanish squadron based near Havana during the War of Jenkins Ear. The battle occurred on the morning of the 12th and ended on the 14th of October 1748. The belligerents consisted of two squadrons under the command of Admiral Don Andres Reggio of the Spanish Navy and Admiral Sir Charles Knowles of the Royal Navy, respectively. The British succeeded in driving the Spanish back to their harbour after capturing the Conquistador and ran the Vice Admiral's ship Africa on shore, where she was blown up by her own crew after being totally dismasted and made helpless. Although the advantage had clearly been with Knowles, he failed to use this to deliver a decisive blow. 1773 America's first insane asylum opens. Eastern State Hospital is a psychiatric hospital in Williamsburg, Virginia. Built in 1773, it was the first public facility in the present-day United States constructed solely for the care and treatment of the mentally ill. The original building had burned but was reconstructed in 1985. 1792 The first celebration of Columbus Day is held in New York City. 
Columbus Day is a national holiday in many countries of the Americas and elsewhere which officially celebrates the anniversary of Christopher Columbus's arrival in the Americas on October 12, 1492 Julian calendar, it would have been October 21, 1492 on the Gregorian proleptic calendar, which extends the Gregorian calendar to dates prior to its adoption in 1582. Christopher Columbus was an Italian explorer on behalf of Spain, who set sail across the Atlantic Ocean in search of a faster route to the Far East only to land at the New World. His first voyage to the New World on the Spanish ships Santa Maria, Nina, and La Pinta took approximately three months. Columbus and his crew's arrival to the New World initiated the Columbian Exchange which introduced the transfer of plants, animals, culture, human populations, and technology between the New World and the Old World. 1793 – The cornerstone of Old East, the oldest state university building in the United States, is laid at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. Old East is a residence hall located at the north part of campus in University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. When it was built in 1793, it became the first state university building in the United States. The Wren Building at the College of William and Mary in Williamsburg, Virginia, was built in 1695, but William and Mary did not become a public university until 1906. 1799 Jean Genevieve Labrosse becomes the first woman to jump from a balloon with a parachute. Jean Genevieve Garneron née Labrosse, 1775-1847, was a French balloonist and parachutist. She was the first to ascend solo and the first woman to make a parachute descent in the gondola, from an altitude of 900 meters 3, feet, on 12 October 1799. Labrosse first flew on 10 November 1798, one of the earliest women to fly in a balloon. She was the wife of André Jacques Garneron, a hydrogen balloonist and inventor of the frameless parachute. 1810 – The citizens of Munich hold the first Oktoberfest. The Oktoberfest German pronunciation, is the world's largest Volksfest, beer festival and traveling funfair. Held annually in Munich, Bavaria, Germany, it is a 16- to 18-day folk festival running from mid or late September to the first Sunday in October, with more than 6 million people from around the world attending the event every year. Locally, it is called Devisen, after the colloquial name for the fairgrounds, Theresienwieser. The Oktoberfest is an important part of Bavarian culture, having been held since the year 1810. Other cities across the world also hold Oktoberfest celebrations that are modeled after the original Munich event. 1822 – Pedro I of Brazil is proclaimed the emperor. Dom Pedro I, nicknamed the Liberator, was the founder and first ruler of the Empire of Brazil. As King Dom Pedro IV, he reigned briefly over Portugal, where he also became known as the Liberator, as well as the Soldier King. Born in Lisbon, Pedro I was the fourth child of King Dom João VI of Portugal and Queen Carlota Joaquina, and thus a member of the House of Braganza. When the country was invaded by French troops in 1807, he and his family fled to Portugal's largest and wealthiest colony, Brazil. 1849 – The city of Manizales, Colombia, is founded by the Expedition of the Twenty. Manizales is a city and municipality in central Colombia. It is the capital of the department of Caldas, and lies near the Nevado del Ruiz volcano. Currently, the city is the main center for the production of Colombian coffee and an important hub for higher educational institutions. Manizales was founded on October 12, 1849. The city was founded by a group of 20 Antioquians who came from Nira and Salamina. There is a strong Spanish influence in the culture and the population was very homogeneous, mostly white, until other ethnic groups migrated to the city, attracted by the universities. 1901 – President Theodore Roosevelt officially renames the Executive Mansion to the White House. The White House is the official residence and workplace of the President of the United States. It is located at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue, Northwest in Washington, D.C., and has been the residence of every U.S. president since John Adams in 1800. The term, White House, is often used as a metonym for the president and his advisors. 1933 – The military Alcatraz Citadel becomes the civilian Alcatraz Federal Penitentiary. 
The Alcatraz Federal Penitentiary or United States Penitentiary, Alcatraz Island was a maximum security federal prison on Alcatraz Island, 1.25 miles kilometers, off the coast of San Francisco, California, United States, the site of a fort since the 1850s. The main prison building was built in 1910-1912 as a United States Army military prison. 1945 World War II, Desmond Doss is the first conscientious objector to receive the U.S. Medal of Honor. Desmond Thomas Doss February 7, 1919 to March 23, 2006, was a United States Army corporal who served as a combat medic with an infantry company in World War II. He was twice awarded the Bronze Star Medal for actions in Guam and the Philippines. Doss further distinguished himself in the Battle of Okinawa by saving 75 men, becoming the only conscientious objector to receive the Medal of Honor for his actions during the war. His life has been the subject of books, the documentary The Conscientious Objector, and the 2016 film Hacksaw Ridge. 1964 The Soviet Union launches the Voskhod 1 into Earth orbit as the first spacecraft with a multi-person crew, and the first flight without pressure suits. Voskhod 1 was the seventh crewed Soviet space flight. In October 1964 it achieved a number of firsts in the history of crewed spaceflight, being the first spaceflight to carry more than one crewman into orbit, the first flight without the use of spacesuits, and the first to carry either an engineer or a physician into outer space. It also set a crewed spacecraft altitude record of 336 kilometers 209 miles. 1984 – The Provisional Irish Republican Army failed to assassinate Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher and her cabinet. The bomb kills five people and wounds 31. The Brighton Hotel bombing was a Provisional Irish Republican Army IRA, assassination attempt against the top tier of the British government that occurred on 12 October 1984 at the Grand Brighton Hotel in Brighton, England. A long delay time bomb was planted in the hotel by IRA member Patrick McGee, with the purpose of killing Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher and her cabinet, who were staying at the hotel for the Conservative Party conference. Although Thatcher narrowly escaped the blast, five people connected with the Conservative Party were killed, including a sitting Conservative MP, and 31 were injured. 1992 A 5.8 earthquake occurred in Cairo, Egypt. At least 510 died. The 1992 Cairo earthquake occurred at 1509 local time, 1309 coordinated universal time, on the 12th of October, with an epicenter near Darshur, 35 kilometers, 22 miles south of Cairo. The earthquake had a magnitude of 5.8, but was unusually destructive for its size, causing 545 deaths, injuring 6,512, and making 50,000 people homeless. It was the most damaging seismic event to affect Cairo since 1847. 1999 Pervez Musharraf takes power in Pakistan from Nawaz Sharif through a bloodless coup. The 1999 military takeover in Pakistan was a bloodless coup d'etat initiated by the military staff at the Joint Staff HQ working under Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff Committee General Pervez Musharraf seized the control of the civilian government of publicly elected Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif on 12 October 1999. Simultaneously tenuring as the Chief of Army Staff, 2013 51 people are killed after a truck veers off a cliff in Peru. On October 12, 2013, a cargo truck carrying 51 people, including 14 children, plunged off a 200-meter cliff, killing everyone on board. This incident is currently tied with the 2018 Pasameo bus crash as the deadliest road accident in Peruvian history. According to authorities, the truck, which was being used as a makeshift bus, was traveling to a celebration in the Santa Teresa district, when the driver lost control of the bus as it plunged off a 200-meter cliff into the Chorpimayo River below. 2017 The United States announces its decision to withdraw from UNESCO, and is immediately followed by Israel. The United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization is a specialized agency of the United Nations UN, aimed at promoting world peace and security through international cooperation in education, the sciences, and culture. It has 193 member states and 11 associate members, as well as partners in the non-governmental, intergovernmental, and private sector. 
Headquartered in Paris, France, UNESCO has 53 regional field offices and 199 national commissions that facilitate its global mandate. 2019 Eliud Kipchoge from Kenya becomes the first person to run a marathon in less than two hours with a time of 1 hour 59 minutes and 40 seconds in Vienna. Eliud Kipchoge EGH is a Kenyan long-distance runner who competes in the marathon and formerly competed at the 5,000 meters distance. He is the world record holder in the marathon with a time of 2 hours 1 minute and 39 seconds, set on 16 September 2018, at the 2018 Berlin Marathon. His run broke the previous world record by 1 minute and 18 seconds. He has been described as the greatest marathoner of the modern era. 2019 The CC, killing 2 and injuring 20. 1031 Canal is a partially collapsed 190-foot-tall multi-use high-rise building in New Orleans, Louisiana, located at 1031 Canal Street in the Central Business District. If completed, the project would have been known as the Hard Rock Hotel New Orleans. The project has undergone a lengthy and controversial development process. On October 12, 2019, the under-construction building partially collapsed, as of 2020, the building site remains in its partially collapsed state. Government officials are debating the project's future and potential culpability of various people and organizations involved. Thanks a lot for watching the History House YouTube channel. Please like this video. And subscribe the channel for latest stories on daily basis.